we have a deadline and we need a faction. Welcome back to WWE 2K23, My Rise, The Lock. I am your host, Attack Slug Bro. Hey, bro. I know you're looking for help, but I'm going to cut to the chase. You're kind of uptight, and I've already been through that with Randy. Randy. No way, bro. Me? Uptight? I'm super cool. So relaxed. We could definitely hang. <clears throat> bro. <laughs> okay, bro. Then show me you can let loose by riding a scooter out to your next match while copying my entrance. Do that, then I'll know you can hang. Okay, then. Deal. Deal. I just need to borrow your scooter. You don't already have one? I'm having second thoughts. Everyone should have a scooter, bro. <sighs> Mine's in the, uh, shop. The scooter repair shop, which is definitely a real thing. Oh, okay, bro. You can totally bogart mine. Look forward to seeing your goofy side. Let those flops fly. Bro with the flow. This I gotta a see. Cool persona this and a I gotta see. Respected mixed martial arts background. Riddle is here to fight. Wait, that's not Riddle. What the heck is going on here? Uh, I don't know, but he's acting like Riddle, scooter and all. I have no idea why he or anyone for that matter would want to do this. He's actually pretty good on that scooter. Maybe he's been practicing. Don't fall. Don't this fall, bro. This is really the time for goofing off like this. He's got a deadline approaching where he needs to win the championship or he's gone from WWE forever. I think I'd be more focused on that. Or maybe there's more to this we don't know about. Or maybe the stress of the deadline has caused him to lose it. Who knows? Let those flops fly, bro. He's certainly got Riddle's mannerisms down, Pat. No Again, pyro? I hate to be the downner, no but birds? that's not going to help him win this no match, let alone overcome Bro. the difficult odds he faces trying to gain Slade's championship before SummerSlam. I just don't get it. Oh, here we go. It's Veer. Veer is here on Raw. Veer is coming. Attempt to win the match against the monster known as Veer. I mean, it says, it says attempt to win, right? So it's not, hey, you have to win. Because all Matt Riddle wanted was me doing my best bro impression, bro chacho. So if I can beat Veer, even all the better. But I don't have to, which I guess is the important part here. With Veer, down goes Veer. Working on the arm of Veer. And we know the arm from his baseball days, you know, take down his greatest asset there. Woo! Onto the back with that cross Baday Hua Hadouken didn't quite get it. Didn't quite get it. I tried though. I tried in a scoop slam from Veer. Nah, Veer, I hit triangle. I think you'll find that happened. So deal with this DDT to Veer. Now, what I was trying to do when you stopped me was Hadouken. There we go with that. So, some video game business in a video game. What else is new? Down on the D-pad gives me that because it is some business with the weights detection. Boom! With the chiropractor. Three count. One, two, and a two count. That's fine. Look, Veer. You will go down to the lock. The slug. The Veer might be here, but the slug has that amateur wrestling background and a knee to the face. Is always effective. I don't care how big you are. I don't care how big you are, Veer. Woo! Shooting star. Thanks, Graves. Pick him up and get him back into the ring because we have our signature that somersault unprettier. And I noticed that Slade also uses the unprettier. And that's interesting. I didn't know that. But also, Slade has the black trunks because he is a main eventer now. And that was a thing for a while that. It, anyone who did main event stuff had to wear black trunks because Austin got so over. Just because Austin and Goldberg both got super over being bald guys with black trunks doesn't mean that everyone has to do that. It's not the case. It's just not. But that was the thing with Vince for a long time there. And a three count on Veer. Bye bye. Bro, I got it done. Bro with the flow is complete. We only have Tavish. Let's. Before we go into the allies menu here, check on our social media. He's my bro now. And Miz also my bro now. And ooh, look at this. Uh, Edge? 
the Rated R Superstar, and Finn Balor. Hmm. Over in the DMs, we got Goldberg, we got Shinsuke, and we got Kevin Owens. If my faction could contain, like, Edge and KO, that might be pretty good. Edge, what do you got? I need some help. Join my group. Be part of the brood. Okay, uh, I'm the leader, and you can reap the rewards for a change. Way less stressful. But I blew off the rock. Earn some points to show you what I'm all about. Take me on in a TLC match. Yeah, right, sure. On this day, I see clearly. I think I know you. Rough around the edge. Coming down to the ring for this TLC match. The ultimate opportunist. The rated R a superstar. The short-haired, no longer in Judgment Day edge. So yes, he escaped that faction to join my faction. Hopefully. But also, what is hanging above the ring if it's a TLC match. Like, I'm not a champion. I don't think he's a champion. So what is hanging above precariously for the TLC win? Or is it just, hey, there are tables, ladders, and chairs, but nothing is hanging above the ring? Is that the case? Like, okay. Or is it like a contract? Or, you know, what's the deal here, Edge? Because I don't know. But I'll take old man veteran Edge and then perhaps Kevin Owens and make it a win that way. So, here we go. TLC. Tables, ladders, and chairs. Oh my! And beat him at his own game with the TLC rules and immediate DDT from Edge. So, the wily veteran is going to be a problem for me. I can already tell. I can already tell. With really a Canadian destroyer from a Canadian. Okay. Rope break or not. I've gotten in no offense so far. It's going to end up like I did when I fought Goldberg. It's going to be a problem. And again, all right, it's time a powerbomb, a sit-out powerbomb, a perhaps Batista-like maneuver from Edge. And all of a sudden, much like Goldberg, it's going to be difficult. So that's fine. Edge, all right, Edge wants this win badly. Clearly does not want to join a faction. He was in the brood. He was in... Judgment Day, and doesn't want to join my faction, because whatever. All right, so can we go get something for Edge? Poison Arana. That's something. And gets right back up, and I botched the deal there with what I was doing there. And he caught it, and the gut punch. Nope. Nah, Edge. Nah, Edge. How about a hello from your boy Christian with that? Now, is it just pinfall here? Like, but it's TLC. So there are tables, ladders, and chairs, but it's just a pinfall or submission matchup. It's a little bit weird and confusing, but... And again, whenever I want to actually drag, the game says, nah, you aren't allowed. You aren't allowed. How many times has this happened to me? So many times. Punch to the gut. Edge, you're in the yellow. Can I execute a submission on you and make that happen? Because, good lord, with the chiropractor. Is that a rope break? Possibly. No, it's not. Two. But it is a two count. But it is a two count. So, Edge. Got the arm of Edge, which is not in the least. All right, look. Going outside and looking for some hardware. So if Edge wants himself a table spot, I can certainly oblige, considering there is nothing at rings... There is nothing hanging above this very ring, Edge. Uh, I wanted the kick to the face, and Edge with the neck breaker. Uh, I don't want to waste, but Edge has signature, and I don't want any of his many Edge-themed named moves happening to me. So please no execution, please no... Education, educator. Oh, good God almighty. Nah. I'm saving my resiliency just in case I get speared here, which totally could happen as Edge is in the corner, and he wants the spear. He wants, he's calling for it, folks. He wants that spear. I didn't get an option to reverse that spear, but now I will use that resiliency. Not even a one count, Edge. You can't get it. 
done against your boy. Woo! So, give me the table. I am the table. There, Edge. Get up, get up, and get down. It's going to be table time for you, Mr. Edge. Or not. Sure. Swing and neck breaker. I'll take it. I'll take it. Back into a submission hold here. Salt of the earth. And a rope. Well, look, man. What I want is to get Edge onto this table, and that might not happen. Get on. Yes. Get onto the table. Edge. Run. 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 You can run. No stamina. Please don't move. Please don't move. Please don't move. Squished him like a bug. And Edge now. Uh, I want to say I have a corner finisher. I think. Let's double check here on that. I think I do. Oh no, it's against the ropes. Against the ropes with Edge. So I could maybe do that. Or I could do this. So rated R superstar. It's time for a super bit of business right there. And I'll pin you on that. Because why not? One, two, and a two count. And Edge, just by the skin of his teeth, that 2.99 business. Get up, Edge. Slowly get up as I grapple you and bring you to the ropes. And I don't bring you to the ropes. But thankfully you don't have Sigur finish just yet. Just yet. Come on now. Yes. Do this. Get you to the... No. That was not the idea there. Sure. Fine. We'll do the apron DDT. Slingshot. Brain. Busted. Get you up. Get you back in the ring. As my stamina is still just uh, in shambles here. All things considered. And what I want... What I want is to get you over here. And then do my finish. So to the outside. Edge in position. Stunner. Center of the ring. One. Referee. Two. What the hell, Edge? That was everything I had. Everything I had. But again, slingshot, somersault, unprettier. Could that be enough to take out the Rated R Superstar? Ultimate, opportunist, a beater. Okay, so there were tables, ladders, and chairs involved, sort of, but not actually a TLC match. Let me talk to you. Rough round the edge story complete, which means back to my social media, and I do believe that means that Edge is ready to join the group. And but he wants a shot at the title after I win it. We'll see. Now my other options here are Goldberg, Shinsuke, and Owens. And yes, I could also go into Finn Balor, right? So I think. My best option is to have both Edge and Owens, two Canadians that have my back. So, fight Owens, fight KO, it's been a while. This is weird, we aren't really on DMing terms. Well, that could change. Uh, help me take down Evolution. So, Kevin is like, hey man, you think it's to Sami Zayn, but I, so did you. So did you. Do something nice for Sami. So, team up with him and make sure he gets the win. Deal? I guess I could do that, I suppose. Look, man, I need the help of Fight Owens Fight. A means to an end. Even though I have the sinking feeling that Mr. Sammy in the bank, as soon as I beat Slate for that title, is going to cash in on the very same night. Because that's what I would do, and how I would book things, because it makes the most sense. So, meanwhile, Sammy is, yes, Mr. Morning in the Bank still. And so, yes, that's my assumption, based on how wrestling has worked for years and years and years. So, teaming with my old rival, my old nemesis there, Sami Zayn. And who are our opponents? Who are the ones to face us? Ole, 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 ole. So, Alpha Academy it is. Shoosh, please! Yes, Gable and Otis. Okay, bring it on now. My other old rivals. Which means we make sure Sami is always the legal man in this matchup. And Sami gets... The win. Put aside your differences with Sami Zayn and make it a win! So, again, my thing here with tag team matches is 
focus on submissions the whole time because that gets you to win the fastest. So we start with that and hopefully I just don't you immediately tag out. Really? Really? Like immediately. What happened 2K gonna 2K? What happened there? That was really not great. Like super fast Sammy. Ah, oh, good lord. And Otis doing... Okay, I get it, Otis. I understand. It's just don't do the Caterpillar on... Really? That's some good tag team work. I can't get mad at that. Honestly, I can't. I'm in the opposing corner. I can't, I can't get mad at it. But the high drop kick to Otis. And again, the super heavyweight Otis is going to be a problem here for us. So, what we do here is focus on submission. I'm hitting circle. Maneuvers. And keep on rolling through with that. Make Gable break it up and cause the damage. And yes, that's what we do here. Get back in the ring, Otis. Oh, thank you. Please. Please, please, please. Do your thing, thang. Get back in the ring, rang. And get a Hurricane Rana from Sami Zayn with that beard. Yes, a rope break. Well, look, man. I'll do what I got to do with Big Mash Sammy here. DDT. And also, get out of the opponent's corner. I would like that very much so. So, let's get over here, in this direction, Otis. Because I don't know. Don't you take out. Won't you do it? What to do otherwise? The press. The press from Otis. Nah, the DDT. And again, I'm back in the opposing corner where the tags can happen. And I don't want the tags to happen. So get out of that corner. Seriously. Big drop kick, and he rolls back out. Like, it's really obnoxious. Okay. At least that's somewhat near center of the ring, and that got reversed. Don't you do it. Oh, it is. All right. Fine, fine, fine. That's fine. Just don't get a tag. Here we go. Something for me. DDT. Busted him open. And a pinfall. Here comes Gable, which means two... That was weird, but two, which means Otis's head is in the red. Slug taking care of business, and the submission should put away Otis. Maybe crank it in, crank it in. He's, got, he's in the red, man. He's in the red. Like, what the hell? Where'd the meter go? Oh, I hit the wrong button there. That's why. I'm like, what happened? I hit the change controller, uh, change guy button, and that's not what I wanted to do at all. But Otis missed the headbutt, I think? I can't tell. Oh, he's doing, he's gonna, no, he should, Otis, no. Otis, no. Otis, please, no. Good God. Don't, just, really, just a problem, Otis. Just a problem. I have finish. And I have sick. So, Gable not in the corner. And blue thunder block. Nope. Okay, Sammy. Toss Otis into the corner. Finisher, Haluva kick, and a pinfall. Don't rope break me. Don't do it. Want Gable slug? That works somehow. I ran around the referee to do a chop block to Gable. Not the most efficient finish, but it worked, and that should secure me Kevin Owens and Edge for next time in my faction. I'm a tax slug. Thanks for watching. More videos right here. I'll see you then, and I'm out.